because that is what is needed in this hour that's what is needed in this day to be aligned until Shiloh shall come unto him shall the gathering the alignment of the nations the quaking of the nations that is coming for the earthquakes the houses of the trumpet sound just started we started something so we should start on one day 12 a.m to 1 a.m every day i see you i saw you praying by that 12 because something new is betting you it's a new prayer coming out and a new worship and a new sound coming out god says i've given you the worship of revival <laughs> giving you the sound of the spirit the sounds of heaven's readings but you are betting them because when you were standing here i saw the angel of the lord standing before you and that presence was burning here but the presence was pointing at the keyboard but somebody else was at the keyboard and he was pointing at you and i was saying is it him or is it the keyboard and then the person played the plain keyboard left and then you came and i said ah there is a sound a worship realm by prayer betting it is actually by priesthood your priesthood expression your priesthood is being betted into a worship dimension that's why the prayer and fasting has been going on because i see you embarking on fasting three days fasting yes sir yes sir the monday tuesday wednesday that one i told you yes. i saw you embarking on the fasting you are betting a priestly realm the essence of it is already coming god says i am using you to open portals wells for revival in this land thank you father something's going to happen among young people hell there's going to be a wealth dimension that is going to come among young people as that revival is sustained they will say economy has gone down but that revival will knock down what is knocking economy having visions of development for this land yes sir yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. we spoke about it when did you speak about it? two years three years ago i saw you having visions of formal development of this this land because in your spirit you are calling it a city a city yes. but they are calling it a town a village you guys discussed that yes we did we did many times many times see you calling it a city a city and a city shall be Woo! that's why i'm picking it up the bible says and they that fear the lord speak of him how one to another and the lord did what he heard it and he did what he wrote it in the book that's the book that is opening right now because the lord heard it and wrote it that's why i can read it two years later because they wrote it in a book and i see 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 city 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 paved roads mansions I saw designed roads, tarred roads in the middle of the place and amenities began to spring up. Not just schools 
but schools, schools, not just schools, yes, but not just schools, but technology centers. Yeah. ITAI development centers. So it will be a schooling of a higher technology, of a higher dimension, because God is preparing you for the age that the world is going into. Going down, new technologies will be coming up, and you are going to enter into it. I heard, and I saw you praying for it, and you were praying for it, and calling it forth, and calling it forth. Now it is in the scroll of this city because it has been prayed for into heavenly dimensions. Watch some things. I saw the king of the land sending for you. of your impact is going to go out. It's going to go about like fragrance, like incense. Thank you, Father. Blow, not wind. Blow, O south, upon this garden that the spices, the fragrance may spread abroad. It looks like, oh, it's a small, it's a village. It's a small town, but God is about to raise some serious high class people which are young people who are young in this land come on give a shout to them but it will go with the revival it will start with the, the prayer burden has been there and, so, and I see you waking up to pray at midnight and that is that is when the angel of the Lord has been coming and has been delivering the scrolls the wisdoms the patterns, the impartations now we are going to pray that prophetic prayer point that is written in your book of remembrance that you have talked about that you didn't know the Lord came there you didn't know God came I heard you and wrote it down but when he writes it down, witness like me, prophetic witness like us, we will now come into the land and say this, they will now say this is their book. This is their round table, this is their scroll. This is read it back to them. Tell them that I'm hearing and I've heard their prayer. Tell them that I'm hearing and I've heard their words. And they, as you have spoken in my ears, say, your book of remembrance and what's that prayer and we'll say Lord open wells of revival in Aliete open wells of prophetic sound prophetic portals prophetic revival Korobo Shaka Yedebakaba Shaka oh my God Yedebakaba Shaka Yedebakaba Shaka Territorial priesthood. It will make it happen. It will make it happen. For there shall be nothing impossible with the living God. He will even cause rivers to open up in the desert. And highways, highways, double name card road in the middle of the desert. Yes, it's coming down. It's coming down. It's coming down. 
Kabashata, Leteba Kabasoto Kirabashata, Leteba Kabasoto Kibarabashata, Leketeba Kabasoto Keroboshata. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be your name. Koroboshata. Woo! Kibarabashata, Leteba Kabasoto Kibarabashata. Thank you, Holy One. Blessed be your name. Hallelujah. Lift your hands and just thank the Lord. Are, are, are these words true? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, come and bear with me. Yes, sir. They are true. Everything is true. Perfect. The Spirit of God is bearing witness to you in this territory that a new generation may arise and build the purpose of the Lord. Lift your hands and bless the Lord. Thank Him for His prophetic witness. And so the prophetic realm is coming upon your life. And with you is the angel of the territory. The angel sings. He administers sound. And so he leads a prophetic people who will be like those prophesying prophets with instruments of worship that met King Saul. On Kibia Elohim, the hill of God where there was a garrison of the Philistines in 1 Samuel chapter 10. And when they met Saul on that hill, he entered their absolute atmosphere. They were prophesying with instruments of music. And that's why you will see in this place, there will be people who will prophetic sound. That's your territorial deposit. They are digging the well. They are prophetic sound because they are joining the angelic watcher to dig the well of this land. And from there, the river will start to flow. And kings and princes, princesses and daughters of God will start to arise. That barrier that they said, women, girls don't cross in this territory. They don't prosper, advance. They don't move in unction beyond the level that barrier is broken. a stronghold of the devil. There is that heal of God here, but there is that stronghold that comes over the place where God is rising and trying to move. But as they came with the prophetic sound, prophets, but with musical instruments, that stronghold broke and the kingship anointing came. That kingship anointing on Saul and then on David was what removed the Philistines from the land. Tonight, that barrier is broken. That barrier that says you can't cross this level. You can't grow beyond. You can't, you can't be educated. You can't be professional. You can't have prosperity beyond this level. That barrier is broken. And they said nobody in your household or family ever traveled. You will be the one. Because you are moving in the glory unction of the Lord. So this is the nature of the angel. The angel won't speak of himself. He will speak what the Holy Ghost under Jesus Christ commands. So he's imparting that incense so that you open the operations of God into this land and territory. Lift your hands and pray and say, Lord, let your operations begin in Aliyah day. Pray it. Lord, we want the operations of your heavenly host, of your Holy Ghost, of the Son of God, of the Kingdom of Heaven. We give you permission. We open ourselves. We dedicate the land. We say, let the operations of God and his angelic host in our land, let it commence. Instead of the familiar spirits, let the covenant angels begin to move.
the oppression of that body and the angel supplying the incense and fire. Oh wow! We, we are mapping a new map of the spirit is come to Aliyah Day. It shall be released and activated by the spirit of territorial prophecy. A new spirit map, a new map is coming to Aliyah Day. It will be activated by territorial prophetic spirit. Children of God, prophetic psalmists, prophetic worshippers, who know the sound of incense, are being, you are being activated right now. A new song, a new sound, with a new prayer dimension, has started coming out of you. It started staring you. You are now releasing and betting by incense. You are betting incense right now. Change your prayer now. Move into this one. Flow into this new sound. Let the highways be open. Let the rivers start to pour out. so that he can give it to them. He has the power, the signs, the miracles, the impartation, the wisdom to impart the territory. But he won't function in every environment. He will only function limited way and he won't be able to talk much. But when he finds the structure of the land that matches heaven's structure, that kingdom come, that will be done on earth as it is. When he finds a structure that lies up with heaven's heart, he will find an office there that he can be resuming. Kaya. And he will be depositing things. And the next thing you will see small boys, they suddenly break into glory. Yeah. You will see small
small girls, they suddenly hit dimensions. You will see poor men, they suddenly hit millions. They are not doing 419, you know, and they are not hustling. They just break into it because their heart is in the kingdom. You're wandering here and here, and foreign currency is coming to meet me here. You are not standing in a local gate, you are standing in a global gate locally. If you are here, give a shout to the Lord. You know, I, I used to say these things like joke, like joke, until it began to happen all around. Began to happen. We were excited. Okay, maybe God will just do small. God will now overdo it. I said, which one is next? It's okay. Just let's. If you just give up, we manage. We overdo that one. Too. And we manage. Is this not this small boy that we know? How we see? If you lack, say spirit structures. Say kingdom structures. Something in this land is graduating from your denomination onto kingdom spirit structures. That heaven's angelic traffic can work with. They can they can deposit them. Somebody say, how do you preach so deep? I don't I don't preach deep, but the place I'm representing is deep. So when they want to speak, they speak through me. And when they speak, they are deep. So it will be deep. As for me, I'm a very simple guy. I don't even like complications. Amen. At all, at all, self. At all. Amen. So, so this is, we, we speak from heavenly structures. We don't just talk because we are wearing portfolio. Because that is what is needed in this hour. That's what is needed in this day. To be aligned until Shiloh shall come. Unto him shall the gathering, the alignment of the nations. The quaking of the nations that is come. For the earthquakes. of the trumpet.